Hey, welcome to another best of AI tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can upscale images from Midjourney. And what upscaling means is basically making the, the image a higher quality using AI. When you export images from Midjourney, the images sometimes are really grainy. And if you're trying to get something like a higher quality for printing, for posters, for graphic design, or for fashion items that you're trying to create, whatever the case may be, You'll, you'll want to make that image a higher quality, and that's what we're going to do with upscaling. So the first thing is I'm going to go to bestofai.com, which is a database where you can actually search and browse different AI tools. And I'm just going to type in upscale and scroll down here. And we're going to go to this first one. This one seems to be one of the best ones, and it's completely free. So what I'm going to do is click on a visit website. And at that point, what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Uh, get the image from Midjourney. So if you're not familiar with Midjourney, just go into your Discord account and then you'll be able to download in, any of the images that you have created. So I'm just going to find one that I think needs to be upscaled. This one, for, for example, needs to be. So what I'm going to do is just click on it, click on open in browser. And once that is opened up, you can see here that this is a bit grainy, right? So I'm going to click on save image, save image as. And now that I have this image downloaded, what I'm going to do is just exit out of here and go back to upscale media and click on upload image. And then from here, I'm just going to select that image that we just downloaded. And that's going to process and it's going to give us a upscaled version of that image that we just uploaded. Okay, sweet. So if we go to the original, this is the original image. And if we go to upscaled, you'll see here that we have a normal upscaling and that we have AI upscaling. To be honest, I'm not too sure what the difference is between just original or normal upscaling versus AI upscaling. I always do the AI upscaling. It just looks a bit better in my opinion, just a bit more crisp. Um, the tones are a bit darker and the, the light is a bit lighter. So I just like that one. And then all you have to do at that point is click on download image and you're pretty much done. It basically doubles the size of the original image so that you can have a higher quality AI generated image so that you can start using it for posters, graphic design, fashion design, whatever the case may be. You can start using that today. So that's it. Very short video, but it's really informative. It's a helpful video. I know I was struggling. How do I make my mid journey images of higher quality? And this is how you do it. So that's it for this video. But if you want to make sure you stay up to date on other tutorials, make sure you subscribe and hit that alert bell so you know we launch a new video. Also, make sure you go to bestofai.com to browse over 7,000 AI tools that can help you in your business workflows or personal life, just like we did here in this video. But that's it for today, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.